Hey guys, me like big boom here, bring you guys another mod A. Today's mod is a complete, like, big giant, I, I forgot the name of it, but it's basically just a big pack by the Ape Mania. Basically the Ape Mania, I did a showcase of his computer asset pack, which is right here. It contains all these different items right here, and I recreated my little gaming setup right here. Pretty cool. And he also has tons and tons of different models on mods-unturned.com, and basically he just released all of them into one little pack, and I'm gonna be showing you guys that pack here, and it contains a lot of stuff. So I'm probably not gonna have time to showcase all of them, uh, but uh, I'll, I'll show you guys um, as much as I can. So first up, I'm gonna go through all the army and prison stuff that he added. Now these are all items that you can add into the level editor. They aren't usable objects. They're for the environment. For his army stuff, he added a bunch of barbed wire. Barbed broken, barbed door, barbed broken, barbed door open, door open. Oh god, army barbed wire. There we go. Alright, let's do this one. So as you can see, it spawns sideways, strangely. But I believe it is supposed to be like so, maybe? No? I think it's supposed to be like this. And then those pillars go on the ground a little bit. So they're supposed to be like that. Anyway, so they look like that. And then you can, of course, copy them and paste them like so. Until eventually you've lined the length of your whole building like so. Pretty cool. And then there are also different sections. There's prison barbed wire, which I'll show you this prison barbed wire. And th these ones are kind of a gray color scheme rather than the green ones. I personally like these ones a little bit more. They look more like metal rather than this kind of just looks like a strange color. Uh, but I don't know, it might look more fitting if it is actually in a military location. So military barbed wire and prison barbed wire. I'm going to turn this upright so you can see it. Pretty cool. And then in addition to that, there are like broken sections like this where it's got like a hole in the middle like that pretty cool and then same for the prison with the gray color scheme um, and then there are barbed doors which as you can see they are sections of the actual barbed wire except it has a door in it and I don't think these are functional but there is an open version um, and a broken version so as you can see this one has been broken down it's like on the ground and then there's also just one where it's just open like this and then, so you can just leave them like that to allow the player to walk through them or um, walk through a broken one. Anyway, so there there are all sorts of different color schemes and different instances where there's broken fences and broken doors and open doors, closed doors, all that stuff. But it's all in the green and gray color scheme. Very cool. And those are all the prison and army different stuff that he's added. And then in addition to that, he's also added a bunch of beach stuff, which is pretty cool. So I'm just going to make a real quick beach over here. Let's just uh, level. No, environment. No, terrain, heights. <sighs> lower. All right, there we go. We got a really, really small beach. I'm not sure what's going on. I think this whole world is just at like extremely low, but you can't, I don't know what's going on, <laughs> but all I know is that we have at least a little bit of a beach for us to work off of. Um, so, oh crap, bake the details. There we go. So there are little surfboards that you can stick in the ground all with different colors. As you can see, come on, this stupid typing thing is just, come on, S, U, R. There we go. Surfboard blue, red, and yellow. I'll just place them all down because there isn't that many. But this one is yellow, like so. And it also has a little fin on the bottom if you want to have that sticking out or have it like this where it's the front is stuck in the in the sand, like so. Maybe make it a little bit crooked. Like that. Drag it up a little bit, like so. Got a nice little surfboard like this and it's got stripes on the front. And then there's also a blue color scheme and a red color scheme. Very cool. So those are all the surfboards. You can stick them in the ground, you can put them in the water, you can lay them down on the ground, however you want them to. Um, then there are also some little chairs. Desk chair blue, desk chair green, red, yellow. Um, basically these are little beach chairs like this. I don't know why it says desk chair, but you know, they're, they're little fold out chair, chairs that you know we, we bring out to the beach to have a good old time. How do you, what, how was this folded? What the? I think it's supposed to be like that, possibly. <laughs> and um, as you can see, place them down like that, and you sit on them. And they come with blue stripes like this, and green stripes like this, and red stripes like this. All sorts of different colors, all different chairs. 
you to spice up the beach. I mean, even without me, like, actually strategically placing these around, our beach is already looking pretty fantastic. <laughs> Let me just put these in the ground a little bit. There we go. Got the chairs laid out. This one's in the ground. Like, somebody forgot about it and didn't care about it. Uh, but those are some of the beach items, and there are even more. There are some umbrellas, lots of different colors, as expected. Everything else is... All coming in fantastic colors. It takes about 35 years to figure out how to type in what you want. Am I spelling umbrella correctly? It's an M. Everybody calls it umbrella, not umbrella. Maybe I'm saying it wrong. Umbrella blue, green, red, and yellow. That, that is a big umbrella. Well, actually, no, it's not. I mean, comparatively speaking, that's pretty, uh, pretty good size. Anyway, we got blue umbrellas looking good. I'll just move these over to uh, provide some shade for our folks sitting over here, right there. Got a blue one, got a green one, and a red one, and a yellow one. Looks like all of these items are coming into the same color scheme. We have uh, uh, yellow, green, blue, and red, those different colors. Pretty cool, and the beach stuff still does not stop. We have some towels as well, and surprise, surprise, blue, green, red, yellow. <laughs> and uh, these are just kind of flat things that you can put down on the ground. There, there's a giant towels. Well, not really. But anyway, you lay them down. Got, uh, I mean, I mean, I guess you can make it kind of look like a wall if you line these. But anyway, uh, blue one right here. Green one, oops, green one right there. And a, oh, come on, let me place it. Red, there we go, very cool. I would spend time to put those flat in the ground, but you know, whatever. And then still, we got some more, we have coolers. Man, dude, you can make a fabulous beach with this. Surprise, surprise, yellow, red, green, blue. And these, okay, get the heck out of my face. Get, keep on accidentally clicking those. All right, there we go. Little beach cooler. Um, if you'd like, you could get fancy and put some extra stuff in it or put some item spawns. Ooh, yeah, you know, put some food spawns, some item spawns in the inside of these. Pretty cool. So transform, put Q. Very cool. That's a blue one. Most fitting, I, I think most beach coolers in the world are blue, but if you'd like, you could get some green ones, and some red ones, and some yellow ones, of course. So you could have kind of a, a color scheme going on, or maybe a all red or all yellow, or you can just mix it up and make it a, a colorful rainbow beach. There are even more than that. We now have beach balls. So beach balls, 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 balls. Give me my balls. And this one only comes in blue, green, and yellow. No red beach balls, unfortunately. Apparently nobody likes red. But I'm going to leave these floating in the water a little bit. This is the yellow one. And then there's a green one. I'll put this one over here. And then I'll, I will put the blue one stuck in the sand. Anyway, so just little spheres that are striped and apparently spiked. <laughs> but anyway, so those are the beach balls. Very cool. Yellow, green, and blue. And then there are even more beach stuff. There are beach booths. Now, these are kind of interesting. Beach booths. I'm not sure what to expect with this. But booth. Okay, booth, 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 booth. Beach booth. Blue, green, red, and yellow. Surprise, surprise. I should just stop showing you guys all the colors. I think we got a pretty good idea of how this works. So I think this is supposed to be like a little changing station or a restroom or something. Um, but I know that they are on beaches. And I've never really used them. I'm not sure what they're for. But they are booths in the beach, maybe for changing into your swimsuits. This is a yellow one. There's a bright green one. I'm assuming a bright, oh yep, bright red one. And then the yellow one, which we placed down there. What am I missing? A blue one, yeah. What does a blue one look like? Oh, blue one, not as bright, pretty cool. I like that, I like that blue, that's good blue. But anyway, those are all the beach boosts. I will delete all the sideways ones. And there we go, we got a yellow one over there. And the last of our beach items, we have a lifeguard tower. So, life, oh my god, will you let me tap? Jesus, lifeguard tower, here we go. So lifeguard tower leaves you room to put a ladder, which is pretty cool, because there's ladder models already in the game, so you can put a wooden one or a metal one right there, and then you can climb up to the top and look around and be a lifeguard. So anyway, um, those are all the beach items, very cool. It's very nice to have um, some models in the game that just we don't simply have like at all. Um, we don't have like any beach items at all, so it's pretty nice to have some some beach items to spice up the beach rather than just leaving it a big sandbank. So pretty cool. Those are all the beach items. Now next up we have tons and tons of different army sections. They're like actual walls of army, like it's just they're like castles almost basically. You 
spawn them in and they're just like walls this one's an entrance so it's got like a doorway in it and it's got a walkway up top for people to walk around in and then this is an entrance and then there's also just like a straight wall like this one uh, like so and there are like tower sections for the corners and with these I mean there's 90 degree t uh, turns and like ladders and stuff like this um, all these you can piece together and make like the perimeter of a military base and it's super cool so those are those are just like the army things um, I'm not gonna spend like tons of time making a little army place but you can use these blocks and connect them together to make your own unique little army base which is pretty cool so those are in the game as well there are fortified versions and these ones are just like made out of stone I personally prefer these ones once again they just seem more like stone rather than a kind of a fancy painted color um, more military like because most military places at least in my mind have uh, just metal or stone walls so anyway those are like all the military things you can combine these like your connected buildings together with the barbed wire to make some super fancy buildings and then with your beach items like over here you get super fancy beaches and then I have already set up before in Amade these electronics mods and you can put these in your military base as well to make some sort of communication center um, but if you guys like to check out the electronics mod in detail I will link that video on the screen right now but all of these models are in this mod pack which is very cool so with that uh, electronics mod that concludes all of the items in the Ape Media mod pack there are tons and tons of items and it is awesome they're all very well modeled if you guys would like to download this mod pack I will link it in the description down below and if you also come across some mods or create mods of your own for the unturned community make sure to comment them down below so I can have more ideas for future mods but that is all I have for now make sure to rate comment subscribe and do all that to brush because me like big boom is that it?